Hi, Matt from Invariant here. Welcome to the tutorial for using the text variables in Wrapper Plan. This handy tool will allow text to be dynamically filled on an area of your plan, based on built-in variables or custom variables you can create yourself. Variables can be used on a specific plan or optimised to be used throughout your entire time with the software. Text variables are particularly helpful when using print frames or creating your own plan templates. I will link a tutorial video for using print frames in the description below. Now I'll show you how to use variables by putting in my plan details. To start, I will create a text box to put some of my plan information in. My plan pictured here has its own title and also its own scale. The text variables will allow me to display these values dynamically on the plan. When entering text variables, I can use them by beginning with a dollar sign, and as you can see, a pop-up box will display with a list of all the variables available. I will use my plan title as a variable. I can then double click on the title variable to place it in the text box, or alternatively, I can type the rest of the variable out. I'll also put my plan scale in the text box as a variable as well. I'll use both the absolute and relative plan scale variables we have available. Reflected on the plan, you can now see the information has been dynamically filled. The real power of text variables lies when I copy this text box to another plan. As you can see, when I paste it into the other plan, the text object, it will not need to be edited, as the variables will adjust the text to reflect the values of the new plan. Please just note that the text variables can be used on any object containing text, such as signs, objects, etc. Now, coming back to our original plan, you can also create your own custom text variables. To create one, we just come up to Tools and click on Text Variables. In the Text Variables menu, we can see the list of inbuilt variables. Clicking on Create New Text Variable will allow you to set out your own variable with its own values. I will now create my own. For this example, I will name it Disclaimer. And then in the value box, I enter into the information that I want to be pre-filled. I will copy this disclaimer information that I prepared earlier, and then hit save. I will create a text box to place the disclaimer on my plan. I will then go ahead and put dollar sign and type disclaimer. When I click off the text box, this will then pre-fill the information I specified in the custom variable. Now this variable can be used on any other plan I use in the future, saving maximum time and effort. That sums up how to use the text variables. Thank you for watching the video. Please subscribe below to be updated on new tutorials for Rapid Plan.